mpya wa kitaifa wa dharura na kukabiliana na elimu amesema kwamba serikali imeweka mikakati kabambe ya kijiri tayari baadhi ya mabwawa yakiwemo thwake karimenu na sasumwa miongoni mwa mengine tayari yamevunja kingo zake na kuibua hali tete mwege william anatoarifu mengi zaidi vifo zaidi vilivyosababishwa na mafuriko yanayoshuhudiwa nchini vimeripotiwa Jumanne serikali ikitangaza kuwa miili tisa ilipatikana Mombasa na nne kutoka ziwa Victoria County ya Kisumu jumla ya vifo hivi vikifikia 120 Naibu Rais Rigathi Gachagua sasa kilalama kuwa ukosefu wa mipango kabambe katika kushughulikia El Nino ndio chanzo kuu cha maafa na uharibifu unaoshuhudiwa The situation we are having in El Nino is because of lack of proper infrastructural planning poor drainage systems in our cities. Katibu katika Wizara ya Usalama wa Ndani Raymond Molo ametahadharisha kuwa hali imekuwa si hali katika kaunti nne kati ya kaunti 38 zilizoathiriwa na mafuriko. Kaunti hizo zikiwa ni Makueni, Tana River, Garissa na Wajia. Through our search and rescue efforts, over 2000 people have been assisted and are undergoing medical checkups at the camps that have been set up. Watu wanaoishi katika nyanda za chini wameshauriwa kuhamia maeneo ya juu huku mamlaka ya ardhi kiripoti kuwa bwawa la Karimenu lenye uwezo wa hifadhi lita bilioni 23 za maji tayari limejaa hadi pomoni mabao mengine yaliyojaa ni pamoja na ndakaine na sasumwa All the major dams are likewise being monitored but Kiambere dam which has just about a meter remaining for it to overflow Those who are in the endangered areas particularly those who are downstream in Kiambere their waters are now at 89 cm remaining please it's good you move to high ground aida serikali imejumuisha jeshi la ulinzi la Kenya huduma ya kitaifa ya polisi walinzi wa pwani ya Kenya shirika la huduma za wanyamapori katika kusimamia huduma za dharura mwege william tv 47 Sasa sana mwege William kwa kutufungulia jamvi la